UMDC ga maulai ba atei bor pathau ringkat ki kendai ngut ki rangba shnong na maulai kila lek ban yu kendu yu menteri rangba ka jela bat yu sembut menteri ban ya tai bat pasat jingmut na ka benta ka jing shong suk shong shingan ki pat ba ka thang Shu shu na kaliang kini ka kenhun kila ai ru ka dor khas ban weng shipo ri ka ktem gi CRP ka bedon ha maulai ka bedei pat ka jaka jang ka tanat arts and culture na kaliang konrat sang mau lai thu ba hadin ka jing ekren ba u inspector general of police jong ka CRPF na kaliang jong inspector general of police ula ker pat ka sorkar jela ban ai jakai ki bikin la ban pelong ktem ba paka jong ki ha kenu kenu ka jaka jela Nakaliang menteri rang ba abr sembut menteri kila ai ktin bikin shim ki kendon ban kendria mardo ri kaktem ki CRP na maulai bat ki bu ka jingkar pa di kini ka kenhun bikin le kat bala ban tem mi ka jingya klumar ka bala ban mi ni kini ki jaka Today um the local MDC from uh, Maulai constituency Shri Taiborlang Pathau along with uh, nine rangbashnongs from maulai area had met me to discuss about uh, some of the current uh, issues that are there and also regarding some of the issues uh, in regards to maulai area first and foremost uh, they mentioned about uh, the recent incident that took place uh, on the 13th of august where uh, the MDC and the other headmen's uh, the Rangbashnongs have urged the government that in the interest of truth to come out a uh, judicial inquiry should be constituted which should be independent in nature so i informed all of them that the cabinet in the afternoon has already taken a decision to constitute a judicial inquiry second was the issue of a uh, CRPF camp which has been a temporary camp for a very long time in Maulai area on a land that belongs to the art and culture department therefore based on the memorandum that was submitted by them i had a, a quick conversation with the IG from C CRPF and uh, the IG had expressed that if the government can give an alternative location and can give a permanent site to the CRPF uh, they would be more than willing to shift to that new location uh, therefore that would be a situation which would be a win-win situation for both sides and based on that the honorable deputy chief minister also was present in the meeting and uh, the honorable deputy chief minister and myself have given an assurance to the um, to the committee that has met us this evening that we will immediately start the steps necessary to shift the CRPF camp from the Maulai site uh, to a permanent location which would be in the interest of the CRPF as well as the residents of Maulai at the same time we have also urged the uh, Rangbashnongs and the MDC and other leaders from Maulai that they should also play an active role in order to ensure that peace is restored in Maulai area and in Shillong city as a whole i'm happy that the Rangbashnongs and the MDC have responded very positively and they have told us that they will do everything in their capacity to mobilize people and inform them and ensure that uh, no further incidents take place and to ensure that peace returns back not just to maulai area but to shillong city as a whole so it was a very positive meeting and i'm hopeful that after this meeting uh, we will see more uh, positive results and uh, not only for the, from the aspect of ensuring that there's peace in the area but also ensuring that the problems related to the uh, maulai area also are addressed and in this uh, area where the land has been occupied by the crpf Uh, we are also proposing that we should have some youth center and some cultural center something that will be productive uh, for the youth of that area so that also was discussed and we will further discuss in detail on how we can develop that area for the benefit of the people of mobile thank you